Blackburn Rovers haven't had the best of seasons so far in the Championship. Tonight, though, they've got the chance to reach the quarterfinals of the FA Cup for the second year in a row. They're going to have to beat Premier League Newcastle at Ewood Park. It's live on BBC One, starts at half past seven this evening. Let's go uh, inside the ground. Ian Haslam is there for us. Big night. <coughs> Big night indeed. Look at this for access. BBC have got the rights for the FA Cup, hence why we're here in front of the tunnel where the Blackburn and Newcastle players will be walking out uh, in about an hour to start the game. They're going to be warming up soon as well. Uh, it's been raining in Lancashire all day. As you can see, probably the uh, wetness is glistening off the pitch slightly, but it's a good surface nonetheless. Behind us here at the Darwin end will be 7,500 Newcastle United fans. What a support they bring. Well, joining me now is P Kevin Gallagher, who's part of uh, Blackburn's greatest ever side, who's also so Bobby Robson's first signing for Newcastle United back in the 99 uh, season, was it? Yeah, 99 season. There you uh, go. Doesn't time fly, Kev. Oh. Now, obviously, Blackburn have beaten lower league sides running up to this to get to the fifth round. Tonight's a whole different task, isn't it? That's a massive task, you know, but the excitement that's gone about the town and when you're playing a Premier League side is just fantastic. So for me, it's it's reliving the times of when Blackburn were actually in the Premier League. So for me, it's, it's bringing happy times back for the fans. Happy times indeed. Now, Rovers are yet to win under new manager John Eustace, who took over earlier in the month. Um, they've drawn three and lost one. Are they heading in the right direction, though? It's kind of different. It's been a different change. You know, we've been very, very open in the way that we've played. And, and John's come in and changed that now he's trying to make it a little bit more defensive making us very very difficult to beat he knows we can score goals so it's just to me the, the case of games at a time and we will probably progress slowly OK, thank you for joining us, Kev. Uh, Newcastle these days are backed by the Saudi millions uh, that are in place there. They've slipped to eighth in the Premier League. The FA Cup's their only chance uh, of silverware this campaign. Manager Eddie Howe has called it uh, a really important game for them, as you would obviously expect. Andy Bayes, Kev's co-commentator on BBC Radio Lancashire tonight. Um, just tell us about this. What kind of atmosphere are we expecting tonight? Well, it's going to be the best of the season by a mile. Whenever Newcastle are in town, it's always going to be an excellent atmosphere. In that the last home game here in the Premier League winning season was Newcastle. 30,000 here that night. Alan Shearer, the scorer for Blackburn Rovers, he's here tonight. So could it history repeat itself this evening? Yeah, probably not. But <laughs> I, don't know, I don't know. Who knows? Fingers crossed. Uh, also in the FA Cup tonight. Thanks, guys. Um, FA Cup uh, fifth round at Manchester City. The holders uh, are at Luton Town. It's also a busy evening in the EFL as well. Loads of uh, North West teams playing. Pick of those games uh, is Wigan versus Bolton in League One. As a Bolton fan, I expect Wigan to beat, win that, unfortunately. Um, meanwhile, Blackpool are at Leighton Orient and Fleetwood uh, face Port Vale in League Two. At Salford host Colchester, Tramier are at Swindon and Accrington are at Walsall. But tonight, the big game here, Blackburn Rovers versus Newcastle. Kicks off at 7.45. Coverage begins on BBC One. Match of the day live at 7.30. Back to you, Rog. Thank you very much, Ian.